Dr. Mika Tosca, an associate professor of climate science at the School of the Art Institute of Chicago, sits down with her student to discuss the intersection of art and science. And we were lucky enough to listen in. Let's go. We wanted to think about how we could imagine and build and create and inspire people to create positive futures within the context of the climate crisis, right? And so uh, one approach to that is utilizing art. Artists can harness human imagination in ways that science currently isn't always able to do. And so this is why specifically we're working on this solar punk project, because you were telling me something about how solar punk is sort of positive versus steampunk, right? Do you want to talk about that? Well, initially, when we were talking about solar punk, a lot of what comes to mind is very visual and aesthetic of like buildings and very landscape and architectural. And so my approach was thinking about materiality and painting things that I could hopefully bring to life that kind of are in line with environment and technology or new innovation and like, how can I paint something so that I can help combat the climate crisis? What's interesting about this project is that how can I translate the scientific knowledge into something that's digestible and feasible for other people to understand and to react to? How can I paint something so beautiful that just makes you want to be a part of where we are and like a part of a future. A future. I focus a lot, you know, thinking about the climate anxieties of my students. How can we build positive futures, no matter if it's a utopia, dystopia, or somewhere in between? If we're able to capture this solar punk ideal or this like positive future after the climate crisis ideal, um, we can make people feel a certain way about it. And I think we can move people to action. 